There's another cool trick you can do that requires Mesmers, and that is a Golem Rush. Uh, now, Golems are really powerful in World vs. World. You can use them to break down gates very quickly, but they require a lot of supply to build, and they're pretty slow. So if you build them far away and try to like run into an objective, there's a good chance that they'll either go down before they get there, or they'll go down shortly after they do. Uh, so in this case, we are stacking near but outside of U of Bay, and we're going to get a port from a Mesmer. And then once we do, we can run up and start attacking the gate. I jumped off from it to heal. Get back on. Let's not be no Ellie's with us. Okay, I'll yep. get right to the gate. Yeah, the gate is hot, but I don't think we have any Ellie's with us. I have yes. a guard on me. Someone, someone shoot that guard. We've got the guard almost to uh, 50% already. I mean, the gate. We need to get the gate down fast because it's hot. My ram's gone. The we need water. Maybe that place. The Alphas do. Yeah. The Alphas do. Oh, they don't. Yeah, I'm in the back here. Okay. Well, how, how far are you can back away, guys, and still hit the gate? That's fine. Whatever your distance is. You just have to be on the corner. Gate almost down. Hey. Let's go in. Team push in, kill that arrow. Pain. Give me the port to south gate. Yeah, south enter. Okay, everybody come over here. Now, in this case, we've gone and we've gotten our golems through the first gate, uh, but Bay has two gates, so we're going to get a Mesmer to port us again into the next gate. Now, when you're doing a golem rush, you usually want to clear as much siege as possible before you start. We had most of our group clearing Siege on the outer gate, um, but inner gate is tougher because we can't really clear it ahead of time. So we're going to be taking a lot more damage on inner gate. Uh, luckily, we didn't have a whole lot of resistance here, and we still managed to get this gate down. Get these guards down. We don't have to worry about too much because this big golem should be able to get in that gate faster than they can do anything. Burn this oil down. There's a cannon on the left. I need that oil down now. Get that oil down. Vision impaired. Make it so hot if somebody does get on it, they can't live. Burn it down, guys. Burn it down. I need I am surprised at their lack of response so far. Achievement hunting. Oil. Get the oil, guys. Focus. We need the oil and cannon. Here comes one from the top. We need that oil, guys. Focus it. I require assistance. Now, when you're in a golem, if you're ever participating in a golem rush, you want to be careful uh, to only use the number one skill on gates. Uh, so you can see I'm in an alpha golem here that has a really powerful punch, and I actually I did this badly a couple times. I used the number two on the gate, which you're not supposed to do. Um, but if you're going to be fighting people, uh, then you really want to use that number two skill. So there was a bit of combat earlier where there were some guards, and I was using the number two. And you'll see the same thing. We're going to take a port to the Lord's Room here. And I'm going to be fighting people using mostly that number two spin skill. Uh, golems are pretty good against gates, but they're not so great against people. Uh, and you'll see I eventually run out of health and die here. Um, but we do end up claiming Bay. Uh, using our golem rush, so I'll let you see the end of that. He said to stack and he'll bring in. The guy's trying to build. Kill him. I could outrun a centaur. Good job. Push. Team, they're trying to get siege. Focus in the Lord's room. Stay together. Try not to chase them around. Just stay in the Lord's room. Stay on target. Turn and burn, Golems. Turn and burn. Spin. 
spin, number two. Refreshing. Dropping time work. Board is down. That warrior has got a banner. Kill him, guys. Stars.